Our next speaker tonight has been our senior pastor here at Stonebridge for over 23 years. That's a type of leadership that's almost unheard of and that we are extremely lucky to be recipients of here at Stonebridge. So would you join me in welcoming my friend and our pastor, Mark Chitwood. Thank you very much, and thank you so much for coming out tonight. I know there's lots of stuff going on in our community, and uh, you've chosen to be here, and, and we're honored that you're part of uh, this uh, great event. It has been quite a ride. We uh, arrived here 23 years ago and uh, was part of a small church that had some big dreams. I think most churches do. Most churches have big dreams, but it, but reaching uh, into our communities is difficult and costly and messy. And, uh, and so these folks were pretty serious and we took them at their word. Uh, I, I think of some of my friends that aren't here tonight because they passed away. I'm grateful for Mike McCrary, the chairman of the board that was here when I uh, was called. And Mike was a bold and courageous leader who cared deeply about this church and this uh, city. Jerry Humphrey, who was also an elder on our board. And Jerry was, one, uh, when I came to interview, uh, Jerry was in the interview room and he, and he had a big beard and lots of tats. And I thought, okay, I can come to this church. And uh, he was an amazing elder that we called on deeply for um, uh, bold and, and fresh starts. I wish those guys were here. I'm glad they get to see it. I wish they could have be in this building that we're building. It would have been a dream come true for them. Uh, a little over 14, 14 years ago, a, a small group of us came out here, and it was a cold day, and we took a bunch of rocks, and we wrote people's names on them, and then we threw them onto this campus. This is, this is one of the rocks, and I saved it. It doesn't have a name on it. I'd like to think that it has yours on it. You're the reason why we're doing this. And if you're looking for a place to call home, this is, I think you'd like this one. You matter to God, therefore you matter a great deal to us. The first time we had a fireworks bonanza, we didn't think anybody would come. So we had a hundred runzas, that was it. And uh, it was all gone within 15 minutes and we didn't know what to do. And so we just didn't do anything and waited for the fireworks show. But it's, it's been really fun to be able to do this. Who would have thought? Who would have thought that we'd be here today? I certainly didn't. We imagined a place, but not like this. Actually, we just imagined a friend. We're not interested in building big buildings and becoming a big church. That doesn't thrill us. That doesn't even interest us. What does is you finding hope, you finding a reason to live. That's why we're here. So we're investing $7 million on this deal. It's a big honking deal. I'm happy to tell you tonight we've already raised over a million dollars. We've already received that. It's super awesome. And thank you for your kindness and generosity. That's an amazing start. But we got a ways to go. And so we hope that you will, if you are part of Stonebridge, keep praying, keep serving, keep giving. I know people kind of say, hey, you know, the Stonebridge, you know, the people say, well, it's all, Mark, it's about you or it's about our worship. Actually, it's not. Our people make the difference. Our people make the difference. Not me. I'm just a guy here. Our people serve and love and care way more than I can even imagine. I'm grateful for all the folks, the thousands of people that call Stonebridge Christian Church home, whether it's in Fremont or Millard or Benson or who knows where we're going next. But we're grateful that you're here tonight. I'm going to pray and then I will keep going. Thanks God so much for this moment in time. Who knows whose name is on this rock that will find their way home and find their way to hope and find their way to heaven. I've got a, a friend in mind. I want him to go to, I want to go to heaven with him. That's my dream. So here we are tonight. Grateful. In Christ we pray. Amen.